It's Spurs women versus West Ham women at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, and I'm delighted to be going. So looking forward to getting to it. And, you know, both sides with nothing to play for, but both will want to end the year on a high, especially Spurs women in front of their crowd. You know, after getting to uh, yeah, the Women's FA Cup final as well, a you know, chance to, to really appreciate Robert Villeman and the girls' incredible work this year. Uh, and all they've done for the women's game on and off the pitch. So do stay tuned to the very end to get my thoughts on this, because it still will be an interesting one. Stay tuned. <laughs> What's happening, people? And welcome back to the channel. I hope you're keeping well. If it's your first time here, don't forget to smash the subscribe button. It's free to do so, and it helps the channel's content grow and improve. At the time of recording, we're getting so, so close uh, to 2K, less than 15 away now. So do smash the subscribe button if you haven't already. If you like you've seen, smash the like button. Helps all people see it. Get involved in the comments because we're very keen to get your thoughts and also turn the notifications bill on. Keeps you know update all our content purely for your own benefit. But let's crack into it because it is Spurs women versus West Ham women at Tom Offer Stadium. The last game uh, of the WSL season for both teams. You know, West Ham you know, narrowly avoiding relegation. Spurs, you know, finished sixth either way. Uh, which is real progress under Robert Villa. And as mentioned in the intro, getting to that women's FA Cup final, okay, yeah, Man United were different quality, a different level in that second half. You know, the depth they had off the bench, different level. They're so much further along their trajectory as a as a as, you know, as a club, if you like, and the you know, severe investment obviously with the Glazers, etc. So they were ahead uh, of us and, and we just done really well to, to get to the final for me. Uh, but in this game, you know, is, is what I see as a send-off, a free hit, a good opportunity. We know that Martha Thomas loves a goal at the top of the stadium. You know, Bethany England loves to do well um, in front of a huge crowd. So I'm really looking forward to this. I think it'll be good. My score prediction, I'm going to go with 3-1 Spurs. i go with a brace from Martha Thomas and a surprise goal uh, from Ashley Neville. Um, who I just love, you know, such an experienced player, so you know, adaptable with the position she can play in. But let me know your score prediction in the comments below. But it's still a London derby, still one we want to win. Uh, it's my first time in person seeing Spurs women, so I'm really, really looking forward to it. It certainly won't be my last as well. I've been, been dying to go for ages. Um, so, you yeah, know, it's absolutely fantastic. Couldn't quite make the cup final. Uh, but I've watched so many games throughout this year, and, you know, I really like how the women's and men's teams have played similar. You know, Robert Villeman in his first year, Angie in his first year, both doing very well. Uh, you know, Spurs women finishing sixth, it looks like Spurs women finishing fifth, maybe even sixth, thick still, but, you know, completely transformed the way playing, you know, new players in and out of the club. Everything's changed, but they still, you know, both got back into a really good position at the table. And, you know, we, yeah, it may be unclear you know, what the aim for Spurs women would be next season. It depends on the players that brought in, but... Yeah, maybe they can push for, for a top four, top five position under Robert Villeman, who I think is an excellent coach. And we need to, you know, really do need to keep hold of. We need to keep hold of key players like like Bethany England and Naz. You know, we need Neville still. We need to keep hold of very key players, goalkeeper and Spencer. There's a lot of players that we need to keep hold of that we, we thrive off of. But that is it for today's match preview. Hopefully we do win the games. Do get your score prediction and any lineup you want to see in the comments below. If you're first time here, as explained at the start of the video, smash the subscribe button. Please leave a like and do get involved in the comments. But for now, come on you Spurs. <laughs>